Blaine Sumner here, week 23, day 4 of Reactive Training Systems. I am one week out of Raw Nationals and two weeks removed from Equipped Nationals. Recap of this week, did three heavy squat sessions, six heavy bench sessions, and three heavy deadlift sessions. Pushing it hard and heavy, right up to the meet, and didn't take a break from last meet. First exercise of the day was pin squat and a uh, hole number two for my stands. This was a one hole lower than how I was doing these, so my depth was pretty good. My first working set was 717 for a double. Here's 761 for a double. And this was done on Saturday. Uh, I did heavy, heavy box squats on Monday, did heavy pause squats on Wednesday, heavy deadlifts Friday night, and here's uh, Saturday afternoon. So pushing it hard and heavy, pushing what my body's capable of in terms of recovery, but feeling good, trying to get ready for this meet. Here's my top set of the day, 804 double at a nine. This got me real excited. Left one rep, left in the tank, gave me a projected max at 888. Um, if this is any indication of where my free squat is, should be closer to 900 again, but we'll see. I was allowing my knees to travel forward more on these than how I usually squat. Instead of pushing my butt back, I was able to stay more upright and allowing the, the knees to travel forward helps me get my depth. Here's a depth check from the side. Can't quite see where the hip crease is, but uh, pretty darn close. Next exercise of the day was rack pulls. Uh, dropped these one hole lower than what I did last week. I uh, did 765 for a double for three sets. Slow control up, slow control down. And then try not to pass out. Hold on there, big guy. Another shot. This is my second set. It sure be nice if I could lock this weight out. That's why I'm doing these. Is uh, they were a recommendation from Steve Goggins, and I'm trying to find the disconnect between pulling off the floor so fast and then missing the lockout and trying not to pass out again. Last exercise of the day was pin press right at the chest level. So these should be a good bit harder than a normal bench press because you're losing all the weight in your hands. Did 4:30 for two at eight on that set. I did two sets there at 4:30, and then did a set here at 4:52. This was uh, kind of an ugly second rep here. Sure taught me how to grind though. First rep went smooth. Second rep was a grinder. If there's ever been a grinder. But locked it out, racked it, called it a day. Feeling pretty good. Shout out to the sponsors, Promera, Titan, Juggernaut, Reactive Training Systems, Rocky Mountain Lifting Club. We'll see you next time.